welcome to easy Alim learning simplified my name is ruth and today we're going to be looking at the topic indices and logarithms and our subtopic for today is logarithms for positive numbers less than one so initially we looked at getting the logarithms of values greater than um, 10 and also values in between 1 and 10 so today we're going to be looking at the ones that are less less than one how do we get that from the table so remember we looked at how a table looks like a logarithm table and these are common logs because they are in the base of 10 and remember this section is add as you can see from your mathematical table so we will start with a, a number that is lower than 10 than 1 so the first thing we said is you get the standard form that brings me to remind you to go back and check this video on converting values into standard form because that is going to help you to tackle this question so the first thing we move the decimal place into the right side once twice three times so that will give us 2.4 times 10 and in this case it's negative 3 so we look at 2.4 in the logarithm table so when you come to 2.4 and 0 because the next value is 0 this gives us 0 0.3802 so this is the same as 10 power 0 0.3802 times 10 power negative 3. So just like we said in the indices, when you have powers, different index indices under the same base, you can add them if it's multiplication. So this is going to be 0 0.3802 plus minus 3. So this is the characteristic, uh, the, the negative sign is the characteristic and then the other uh, decimal uh, so the decimal values are called the matisa so when we write this value we write it as bar 3.3802 this tells us we are putting the negative on top of this to tell us that only the whole number is negative the uh, matisa which is the uh, decimal place or decimal is positive this is now the value we get at the end of the day. So let's do some correction. So we said it's 2.4 times 10 power. So we said this is 0 0.3802, which is a steam. 0 0.3802 times 10 power negative 3, which gives us bar 3.3802. So remember, as we even as we are looking for values that are less than 1 on the logarithm tables, we get negative values because of the power 10. The negative is only on the whole number. We need to remember this concept, especially when we are doing the application of logarithm. So let's look at another question, which is 0 0.28. We change this to standard form as well. So we move the decimal place once to form 2.8 times 10 power negative 1. So 2.8, 0 is 44.72. So that is 0 0.44. 72. So this is the same as 10 power 0 0.4472 times 10 power negative 1. So when we add the index indices, it becomes bar 1. Don't forget 4472. Let's do a few more questions. So we have 0 .0, 0 0.0001413. So we move the decimal place once, two, two, three, four. So you get 1.43 times 10 power negative 4. So we go to 1.4 and then 3, which gives us 0 0.1553. 
So this is the same as 10 power 0 0.1553 times 10 power negative 4, which gives us bar 4.1553. Uh, let's look at this other question. So this is very small. You move the decimal places. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So this forms 2.13 times 10 power negative 5. So we go to 2.1. Now we have another decimal, 3. So we move across to 3, 32.84. So it's 0 0.3284 times 10 power negative 5. So this is the same as 10 power, power 0 0.3284 times 10 power negative 5. So you add the powers to give you bar 5.3284. So let's do one final question. So we, this one is even smaller than other numbers. So once again, we convert our number into standard form. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Six. So this gives us 1.113 times 10 power negative 6. So let's check that from our logarithm tables, the log of 1.113. One so we go to 1.1 and then 1, which gives us 0 0.4, 0 0.0453. And then we have another decimal, which is 3. We move across to 11. So 0 0.011. So remember, we said this is the addition uh, column. So it is 3 plus 1 to give 4, uh, 6, then 4, 0, 0. So it is 0 0.0464. So this is the same as 10 power 0 0.044 times 10 power negative 6. So this gives us bar 6.0464. So that's how we calculate or get the log logs or logarithms of values in the base of 10 or common logs in the periodic symbol. In the, in the mathematical table, uh, in the case where these values are less than 1. Make sure you note the matisa and the characteristic. So the characteristic is the whole number, and then the matisa is the decimal value, because we are going to use this for the application of logarithm. So check out the next video as we get into it and also if you want to get more revision questions uh, on what we have just discussed and also notes download the app and check out these uh, questions to help you to understand the concept so see you in the next lesson